Yeah, technology, technology. Sorry about that, guys. Just bear with me. I'll get better at this, I promise you. It is my first time. But um, again, I think just bringing it back to, to where we were, um, let's, just, let's just start with a prayer. So Lord Jesus, we thank you for this day that you've given us. And we thank you for the blessing of time. Lord, we are so sorry if we have fail to see the time that you have given us it's just that there's so many things that that make us worry that make us stress and it seems as though we try to keep our minds and our bodies occupied so that we don't have to face those things but tonight lord we offer up all these things to you we offer up all of our worries all of our stresses our health our well-being, our livelihoods. We offer up this country. We offer up our government, our president. Lord, we pray that you will just enter into our hearts in a special way tonight. I pray that you, you create a, a space for us to feel your peace, your love, your grace, your joy. Block out everything that's out there, Lord, in the world. All the things that bring us down. Right now, it's just you and me, Lord. Amen.
So never let go, never let go. He loves me. 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 Never let go. Are God of the heavens and God of the earth. You are God of the Savior's birth. You were God on the cross and God on
Got to stay hydrated. We're going to go now into a, a time of worship. And, um, oh God, one too many. Let's get this sung by mistake. There we go. And um, I just, yeah, I know we started off by saying that let's, let's offer up the time to the Lord. Um, I find that the best way to do that, sometimes we don't really know how do we do that. How do we offer up our, our, our issues, our stresses, our problems to the Lord? And um, I'm sure that, you know, there are many different ways, but I find the best way for me is I always 
imagine myself placing it at the foot of the cross um, because that is where the greatest victory happened. And if that is where the victory, the greatest victory happened, then surely that is the place where all, it's, I suppose it's where suffering began, but it also is where it ended. And so let us resurrect with the Lord. And let's offer up all of our concerns and everything that's in your heart right now. Let's just place it at the foot of his cross. And let's trust him. Let's trust that he can use that and take that and turn it into something that can glorify him. God loves you. Don't forget that.
I think if you look at everything that's happening around us, it's easy to get consumed by all the negativity. How can it not affect you when people, people are suffering, people are dying, people are stressed and worried? And I know it's hard, but I think we need to try and remember how good the Lord is. And I'm sure that right now, if you think, if you think carefully, there's probably many many things that you can think of that even during this time have been such a great blessing the father is always good and he does all for his glory he loves you and he wants you he doesn't want to harm you so let's thank God for all the blessings for he is truly good and he is here right now. Open your hearts. Let him in. The Lord wants to heal you. He wants to love you. He's calling you.
can hardly speak of fear so unexplainable I I can hardly think as you call me deeper still as you call me deeper still as you call me deeper still into love To you are, I'm loved by you. It's who I am. It's who I am. It's who I am. Your good, good father. I'm loved by you. Worship you in reaching out to speak these words into your hearts. I worship you, my Lord, my God, with faith declare my love for you. Shit. 
of you. I worship you. I just want to read this reading again because um, when I read it, when I started it, probably um, <clears throat> sounded weird <laughs> with all the echoes and whatnot. Come to me, all you who labor and have been burdened, and I will refresh you. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am meek and humble of heart, and you shall find rest for your souls. For my yoke is sweet and my burden is light. Thank you, Lord, for your word. Thank you for for how comforting your word is, Lord. It truly does give us peace. Lord, I pray that now as we continue to worship you and sing to you, that you just give us the rest that we need, Lord. We're so exhausted, Lord. We are so exhausted. It just seems like there's nothing that's good that's happening right now. Help us to focus on you, Lord. Help us to keep our eyes on you, Lord. Help us to walk on water with you, Lord. Thank you for being present, Lord. And I pray that your Holy Spirit will just search each one of us and find all the things that are hurting, all the things that are bleeding, that you just offer your healing over us, Lord. Pour your precious blood over us all. We trust you. Jesus, I trust in you. Everything is lost And everything I've loved before is gone Alone Like the coming of the frost And a cold winter's chill in my stony heart Oh 
ashamed Hiding in a life I wish I never made You were on the cross Find me here I'll speak to me I want to feel you I need to hear you You are the light That's leading me To the pleasure I find peace again Again You 
You are the strength that keeps me walking. You are the hope that keeps me trusting. You are the life to my soul. You are my purpose. You are everything. How can I stand here with you and not be moved by you? Would you tell me how could it be any better than this? You come storms and you give me rest you hold me in your hands you won't let me fall you steal my heart and you take my breath away would you take me in Take me deeper now And how can I stand here with you And not be moved by you Would you tell me how could it be Any better than this And how can I stand here with you And not be moved by you you tell me how could it be any better than this? Cause you're all I want, you're all I need, you're everything, everything.
just like a hurricane I am a tree bending beneath the weight of his wind and mercy when all of a sudden I am unaware of these afflictions eclipsed by glory and I realize just how beautiful you are now great your affections are for me and oh how he loves us oh oh how he loves us how he loves us so To redemption by the grace in his eyes If grace is an ocean We're all sinking And so heaven meets earth Like an unforeseen kiss And my heart turns violently Inside my chest And I don't have the time To maintain these regrets When I think about the way
want to rise with you, Lord. We want to rise with you. Want to rise with you, Lord. In your peace, Lord, I want to feel your peace and love and joy. Your presence is here. God, wonders beyond our galaxy. You are holy, holy. The universe declares your majesty. You are holy.
God of wonders beyond our galaxy. You are holy, holy. The universe declares your majesty. You are holy, holy. Lord of heaven. I just want to once again thank you so much for joining me tonight. <clears throat> so those who don't know, I've been in lockdown on my own. It's just me and my cat. It's been a bit tough, um, but I'm sure it's been tough for, for everyone. And I just thought this would be a great way for me to share of myself with you. Um, I really, truly hope and pray that the Lord revealed himself in a special way to you today, tonight. And that I pray that you were able to find that place of peace. And just remember that the Lord is the Prince of Peace. And don't forget to turn to Him during this time. Don't forget to offer up everything that's on your mind, everything that's on your heart. Just trust, trust in the Lord. Give Him everything. Don't hold back. Life is too short. I'm sure we all can see what's going on around us and you can see that now is truly a time where we need the Father. Embrace Him. Call out to Him and He will hear you. He will hear your cries. Don't lose hope. May the Holy Spirit be with you and may the joy of the Lord remain in you. If you are... If you don't have me on YouTube, click su subscribe, share. I'd really appreciate that. Put, click on that little bell so that you get a little notification if I ever upload any videos. There will be more coming um, in a week or so. I just want to thank you so much for just spending this time with me. And I think um, let's just, yeah, maybe drop me some mail. Um, and let me know how this was for you and let me know if you want some more of this or if maybe this wasn't so great <laughs> i can i can handle that if that is the case but yeah just talk to me let me know what you want and what you need and um i can only pray that the lord will continue to use me as a vessel and pray for me and pray for my ministry please um and uh i hope to to hear from all of you soon i miss all of you guys and i love all of you guys let us pray Lord God, I just thank you for tonight. I thank you for your presence. I thank you for your Holy Spirit. I thank you for your peace, your love and your joy and your warmth, Lord. I thank you for my health, for our health. But right now, Lord, we pray for all those who are not in good health. We pray for all souls who have been lost to this pandemic. We pray for our country, for our government, every single human in this, on, this, on the face of the earth. We pray for them. Lord, I pray that you just remind us that you're always here. Help us to remember you and to turn to you and to offer everything at your feet, Lord. Remain with us and in us, Lord. We thank you. We adore you. We glorify you. Amen. God bless God.